Hello guys, welcome to my channel and this is articles read series so if you don't know what this series is about, it's about me being as a child having the hobby of cutting newspaper articles you know, interesting articles that would interest me and uh, you know, cutting them and thinking that I would read later but I didn't read for these articles for some reason you know and I'm glad that I have I've kept this in a very safe place and uh, yeah before I discard them or anything um, I'm glad that I can share the knowledge with you so here it goes the Gates story it's about the story of Bill Gates um, early days Bill Gates born on October 28 1955 as the second child to William Henry Gates II, Seattle Attorney Washington and Ma Mary, a school teacher and a chairwoman of United Way International, is originally named William Henry Gates III. Gates has an older sister, Christy, and a younger sister, Libby. Gates grew up in an upper middle class family and began to show an interest in computer programming at the age of 13 at the Lakeside School, an exclusive preparatory school. Gates involved himself reading in reading encyclopedia as a child. He blossomed in nearly all his subjects, math, science, drama, and English. He had a very close relationship with his mother, Mary, who after a brief career as a teacher devoted her time to help helping raise the children and working in on civic affairs with charities. She also served on several corporate boards, among them First Inter Interstate Bank in Seattle, founded by her grandfather, the United Way and International Business Machine, IBM. She would often take Bill along on her volunteer work in schools and community organizations. Personal life and career. In 1970, at the age of 15, Gates went into business with his pal Paul Allen. Gates graduated from Lakeside in 1973. He scored 1590 out of 1600 on the college SAT test. He boasted about when interested introducing himself to new people during his early days. When Gates was in his junior year, he dropped out to devote his life to his company, Microsoft. Gates enrolled at Harvard University in the fall, originally thinking of a career in law. In the summer of 1974, Gates joined Allen at Honeywell. In 1975, Gates and Allen formed a partnership with Micro Instruments, Instrumentation and Telemetry Systems (MITS). They called Microsoft <coughs> a blend of microcomputer and software. In 1977, Ed Roberts, president, sold MITS to another computer company. Then Microsoft wrote software in different formats for other com computer companies and at the end of 1978 Gates moved the company's operation to Bellevue, Bellevue Washington just east of Seattle all 25 employees of the young company had broad responsibilities where Gates placed himself as the head of Microsoft which grossed 2.5 million dollars in 1978 when he was only 23 in November 1980, IBM was looking for software that would operate their upcoming personal computer PC and approached Microsoft between 1978 and 1981. Microsoft's growth exploded and staff increased from 25 to 128. Revenue came revenue also shot off from 4 million dollar to 16 million dollar. In mid-1981, Gallen. In mid-1981, Gates and Allen incorporated Microsoft, and Gates was appointed president and chairman of the board. Allen was named ex 
executive president by 1983, Microsoft was going global with offices in Britain and Japan and with 30% of world's computers running on its software. In November 1985, Gates and Microsoft launched Windows and at the age of 31, he became a millionaire. On January 1, 1994, Bill married Mer Melinda French. However, in June 1994, his mother died due to breast cancer. Gates was devastated. In 1996, their first daughter, Jennifer, was born. With the influence of his wife, Gates took an interest in filling his mother's role as a civic leader. He began to realize that he had an obligation to give more of his wealth to charity. In 1994, Gates and his wife established the William H. Gates Foundation, which was dedicated to supporting education, world health, and investment in low-income com communities. In 2000, the couple combined several family foundations to form the Bill and Melinda Gates Foundation. They started by making a $28 billion contribution to set up the foundation. In 2006, Gates announced he was transi transitioning himself from full-time work at Microsoft to devote more time to the foundation. His last full day at Microsoft was June 27, 2008. Honors. Time magazine named Gates one of the most influential people on of the 20th century. The magazine also named Gates his wife Melinda and rock band YouTube's lead singer Bono as the 2005 Persons of the Year. Gates also holds several ceremony. Gates also holds several honorary. He doctorates from universities throughout the world and an honorary honorary he knight commander of the order of the British Empire by Queen Elizabeth II. In 2006, Gates and his wife were awarded the Order of Aztec Eagle by the Mexican government for their philanthropic work throughout the world in the areas of health and education so this is a trivia okay i finish the quick note quick note here is written bill gates is the founder and former ceo of microsoft the world's largest software business in modern time and through technological innovation keen business strategy and aggressive competitive tactics he and his partner alan paul allen built the world's largest microsoft software where business Microsoft in the process has Bill Gates became one of the richest man in the world. Now trivia. Trivia time for him. Trivia is first point. On December 30, 1977, he was taken to jail on a traffic violation in Abuquerque, New Mexico. Number two, he listed as number one false richest people list for 12 years in a row. Number three, Bill e is mentioned in Bowling for Soup's song, High School Never Ends. Number four, one of the Bill's teachers at Harvard is quoted as saying, he was hell of a good programmer, but he's an obnoxious human being. Number five, he is the biggest charitable giver in his history, mainly through his foundation, which targets Grants at health and education projects. Six legend has that is legend legend has it that at the first meeting with some with him someone at IBM mistook him for an officer and asked him to serve coffee. In number six, he relished playing board games. Risk was his favorite and expelled in Monopoly during his childhood days. So that's it for today guys. This guy is worth somewhat not like not like Steve Jobs. But yeah, that's it. I don't there's nothing I disagree with. He speaks the truth. Thank you very much.